Hi, I'm Mary from TopCon Healthcare University. Today, I'm going to show you how to capture a peripheral color fundus image using the NW500. Ask the patient to place their chin centrally on the chin rest and adjust the chin rest height so the outside corner of the patient's eye is level with the canthus marker on the chin rest post. Make sure the patient's head is firmly against the headrest and adjust the table height to ensure the patient will be comfortable. The pupil should now be positioned within the two blue lines. If not, make small adjustments to the chin rest height to achieve this. To start peripheral fundus photography, go to the bottom right hand side of the screen and toggle the panorama button to on. A touchpad will appear, which has the nine fixation positions. The first position will always need to be the central position, which is automatically selected. Tap the screen to align the pupil. The patient will follow the fixation target. Instruct them to blink a few times and then press Start Capture to commence automatic capture. Once you have saved the image, you will be taken back to the main screen. The device will automatically select the next position or you have the ability to use the touchpad to select the next area to be photographed. Repeat this process until you have imaged all the desired peripheral areas. Throughout this process, the fixation target will move. Instruct your patient to follow the fixation target. After each position, click OK to save the image. Once you have finished imaging the right eye, press the OS button at the bottom of the screen to move on to the left eye. And that's how you capture a peripheral color fundus image using the NW500. For more information, please visit TopCon Healthcare University.